Brockman or something. Albert R. Broccoli. Al wow. Brock. Al Brock. Cubby. Nicknamed Cubby. But just the... the um, Cubibbo. The, the <laughs> fucking people... <clears throat> the people who are like... Uh, you know the Green Brothers? Hank Green and whatever? Yeah. Couldn't you go to YouTube and type in Green Brothers? The, the vlog brothers. They might say uh, Napoleon didn't exist, but when you tell them the Civil War never happened, they usually get kind of upset. Yeah, <laughs> that's the type of guy. The, uh, yeah. These f***ing f***ing Are they married? Okay, who, thankfully, one question. of them has this cancer now, thank oh, God. Ask you Are they brothers? The word they're brothers and shirt. they're marked for death. Like, like but these are the types of guys that's who, you can pause question. it. I'll put a in their far side, Far side the human? Yeah, well, the, these, <laughs> yeah. Are the, these are the types of guys who, well, you don't, you don't know. You know, well, actually, 1921, they said that he invented the light bulb, but he didn't. <laughs> that type of shit. That I'll believe, I will. I'll go. I'll fucking. I will. I'll take one in the chest for the right to preserve the right of every black person to say that Wakanda invented fucking computers before listening to these fucking faggots question one ask anything i don't even care whatever they have to say well actually in 1703 they never painted that painting fucking kill yourselves Ugh. you tell them that uh there, there were no gay romans and greeks see how they take that one they weren't gay you know that that was made up actually they weren't gay well i can think of one historical event that they would never question but i would question every day but i'm not going to talk about I it i forget what you're talking about i think it's the chicago world fair right? in fact i've never heard of it <laughs> yeah chicago world's fair is the, the chicago best. world's fair where they had private jets <laughs> yeah. Keller was flying a private jet and landing there <laughs> blimps that go across the world it's like four dollars to ride it <laughs> <laughs> yeah there was made out of styrofoam so we burned it all down <laughs> oh really God damn. It lit Sick itself on fire. That's how they found out what napalm was. It was styrofoam and gasoline. <laughs> the World's Fair stuff is really the crazy. Even Dresden back in the day, it's so shocking to mm -hmm. see. But I guess they had it coming. The women and the children in Dresden, I think they were had it coming. I love the, yeah, I know the World's Fair stuff is, is it's always. It's incredible. Yeah. It's like they sprayed it on the ground. Like they just, they like shot that out of a tank. It's like big bouncy castles. Yeah, like <laughs> It's like limestone erections. They have the huge crystal castle with uh, even like this electric palace too. Like there are such crazy things that would make you sick seeing. Cr like a the big green, not greenhouse, but where they used to like park the zeppelins in and that thing burned down. Or so. it was just it's all just bullshit. You got you understand. Yeah, this is just structures that were erected for these world's fairs that defy. They're all inspiring structures, and they've sort of magically disappeared. Yep. Okay. And, and you could you could argue. Well, I feel it's irrefutable, but. They use the word founded when it comes to those big buildings. It means they found them. They were already there. They were already there. Like, we're living, we're, like, completely conquered and occupied for hundreds of years. But, I mean. No, you know what they let live, though? They let the row houses by the factory stay intact. <laughs> <laughs> like, let's destroy the uh, the Archangel, Archangel Gabriel, the building. But let's keep those fucking row houses where the fucking sewer, the chain, the scum man lived. They never destroyed any of the sanitariums, the mental asylums that look like giant castles. They didn't destroy any of those because they kept everyone in there that remembered the people that built all the shit at the fairs. At least in my opinion. They stuffed them into the asylums. Can't you see that happening, though? If you, oh, yeah. if you deny certain things, they'll put you in an asylum. It's going to happen again. That'd be cool. Maybe. It's like a shadow of the torturer thing with the... Uh... You remember the, what was the atrium? What did they call that place? Atrium of time? With the drop ceilings. It was, it was the, where the, where the people that sought an audience with the, uh, Autark would go and they'd be interned. House absolute. Indefinitely. Yeah. Yeah. Like but the, they'd be in there. They'd be eating. You remember they were eating coffee cakes. Sweet buns. Drinking coffee. And they, there were drop ceilings and they were just kept in there indefinitely. And occasionally members of the higher cast would come in to torture them with like toys, mm -hmm. like electric toys and such. That shit was horrifying. Yeah. All, all like the seafarers or the Chinese seafarers from back in the day, they're all there. Yeah, man. Oh, that was a nightmare. Good God. Oh, that is such a nightmare. I got to do it again. I yeah. did Dying Earth again. It was, it's just too fun. Yeah. It's too fun, but I, I, it's time to revisit some more Wolf. Have you ever, uh, have you ever looked into Earth, Earth.net? No. It's like an old school, um, text repository communication hub for people who are trying to dig, a, dig apart the uh, Gene Wolfe's literature hmm. called Orth.net. And it's okay. kind of, there's some fascinating oh, I gotta check that like out. fan theories and stuff on there. It's kind of like a, a like a subreddit, but it's not hard because it's people who are communicating via, you know, BBS or email, like old school methods. Oh. So it's like a higher, higher IQ, higher average IQ. Let, let me ask you this. Did you know that Gene Wolfe invented the Pringles uh, fabrication of the chips and the canister? I think you told me that Can before, you believe yeah. that? No. <laughs> oh. and, even his face is Gene Wolfe on the Pringles can. Think of that for a the second. Mustache, the, the mustache guy is Gene Wolfe. It's crazy. <laughs> right. What a, wow. 
What do you think of that? Oh, oh brother. That's a good sticker. What that's, does that mean? That's like, nuts, Charles. Holy shit. What is this guy, a freak maniac? Wow. <laughs> I love chips. I like chips so much, I invented it, and I wrote all this stuff that I, well, I kind of picked up from Jack Vance. <laughs> <laughs> Was he was he inspired by Jack Vance or vice versa? Who came? Oh no, Jack Vance was writing in like in like the. Oh, I, I'm gonna be making things up right now, but I believe he was early. He was oh he was born in 1916. Holy yeah. shit! He he lived in 96. Motherfucker! Thank God he did. He probably well he probably spent most of his life on a boat. Yeah, he, he's the guy that said no one you shouldn't start writing until you're 40. I want I wonder if that's. Wow. Uh, I wonder if that's why he lived so long as he was on a boat his whole f***ing life. The water is healing. It must be. Mm. Sea air. That's why they probably push you inland. That's mm -hmm. why they call waters uh, the wells, because it makes you well, at least allegedly. Thank they you. take everything away. The, the worst thing they ever did was take all the bells down. That's the worst thing anyone's ever did in the world. He was writing in the 60s. What, does, did he have any kids? You scroll down to personal life and just see if he had children. <laughs> just this cocksucker. <laughs> <laughs> he drank his kids. <laughs> Vance's family fortune dwindled during the Depression, forced to leave junior college. He was a bellhop, which was a miserable year. He worked in a cannery and on a gold dredge. Doesn't that sound like one of his books? Like Kujil? Yeah. Being a being a bellhop and then working in a cannery and then <laughs> digging for gold? Yeah, digging for the scales. God damn. In, in Flutic? <laughs> oh my God, man. It's so good. Yeah, and, and Demon Princes is, is crazy. I haven't opened that one yet. It's, there's some stuff in there. There's like, there's like, a, well, I don't even want to use the word because it's so queer, I guess you could say, but I might as well. There's like adrenochrome harvesting in those books, mm -hmm. like making nightmares to scare people. Oh, uh, God. Like, like capturing people and like experimenting until they like self reproduce, like Ugh. trying to get clones of, the, like, it's this, it was really sick. Good God. And it's procedural. It's like uh, it's like Columbo. It's mm -hmm. like a detective thing. It's mm -hmm. it's a lot of fun. Holy! Fuck. Did Westworld attempt to grab some of that from their from their plot lines. Sure, I think yes. Yeah, it's, it's all kind of that with science fiction. It's all like you know the influence is all trickled down. It's all yeah, like a web. Like that, the the maze symbol from like uh, what's that that huh? cathedral? Mm -hmm. Like like the tech the toy box thing. Yeah, like yeah, I can't yeah. describe it. It's some French thing, and and it's uh whatever that maze thing look is, uh it just it looks like the halls of Jer like the walls of Jericho. Like if you look up the walls of Jericho, let's see if I have it handy. Science fiction is very it's very uh, religious. Yeah, and it's um, even even the bleak Black Mirror type stuff. Oh yeah, wow. Even the up. the bleak Black Mirror type stuff uh, is um, yeah. like a religion for it's like an uh, atheistic religion. The way that the themes and influ like everything sort of influences and affects everything else is. It's almost religious. Um, in it's like canon. Yeah. 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 There's like guidelines that everybody sort of uh, admits to and, and like space. What are the yeah. walls of Jericho? I don't know. <laughs> it's the same as the labyrinth what? in Crete with the mm -hmm. Minotaur, also, allegedly. Hmm. But I can't explain this. But this symbol is like yeah, it must Quebec conduct City. energy or something. Like it does something. It's on the floor of one one cathedral and and on a lot of some computer circuits. It has his name on there. Whose name? It's called the um, it's called the John Podesta spiral. It's not chartreuse. It's something like that. <laughs> Podesta. The upper city and lower city of uh, Quebec. It has like a I, maybe it's the walls of Jericho. If uh, what if, if if Jerusalem is in uh, Jerusalem's in the United States? Yep. I kind of have that feeling these days that all the biblical stuff happened in the in the North American and South American continent. I kind of feel that way because the Middle East is clearly cursed and uninhabitable. I don't believe anything went down the Middle East. Mm -hmm. Try smoking on that one. I think it went down North America. <laughs> Hell yeah. In the Middle East, nah, it's, a nah, you, it's that. cursed. You go there, you feel it. You feel it. Is that I mean, true? Yeah. I I mean, I don't know what it was going on where I was, but it was it was uh, nonstop migraines for a year. Oh, brother. It was really fun. Wow. Is it not hard, hardcore 5G towers? Yeah, it's it's the most 5G over there. Everywhere, really? everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. In the dust <sighs> and things. I'm, maybe I'm probably allergic to it. I have no it's idea. It's probably just the damned The souls, area. the ghosts of the damned. Yeah. Like ley lines. You ever look into that shit? Yeah. Yeah. That's some scary shit. What's Star ley forts. Ley lines are like uh, witchcraft lines that span... The, the globe and uh it's like energy conduits people draw oh. people draw maps that show that like school shootings are centered on ley lines and shit they all like happen that. on the 33rd parallel it's kind of spooky actually uh. everything is on the 33rd parallel yeah it's like it's a they're like 
turning the computer against the people of this of this yeah, world. Yeah, sounds right. That's that's logical. It's logical. It's like, irrefutable. Yeah, like that that sounds better than uh, green beings coming. Green beans coming. Green, no, like, like you know, like al- you know, aliens or something. Oh, beans. People always like talking about aliens being like bipedal mm-hmm. and like walking. It just doesn't make sense no. if you were like, if I was ever, I would be dust. I would be marijuana. Yep. Mm-hmm. It would be mar- I, that's how I would take over. My dad something. always said that. He's like, why would they look like us remotely if they're from uh, from a trillion yeah. light years away? Why? Yeah, why that? I, I'm just like you, but I got blue skin. Can yeah. you can you type in uh, <laughs> fist fight you? <laughs> Ley lines school shooting. Shooting. My bones are hollow. You're gonna kill me if you push me. <laughs> He's a cloud of marijuana. You're high. <laughs> Star Force is the most crazy thing. Star by far. When I saw that, I went insane. What's Star Forts? You nothing could prepare you for what these things look like. They're like castles built on ley lines and they're like power generators or convert. I have no idea, but they're like symmetrical, sacred geometry all around the world, even in Rhode Island. Star Forts, they just turn them into military bases that you can't go into. The Star Forts would make you sick when you see them. You'll see them. They feed their flying spaghetti storm god in the sky with uh, murders on the ley lines. Mm. It's dark. Mm -hmm. It's witchcraft. But, uh, I mean, I guess that stuff's kind of really coming out now. It's Mm. not even, you know... Well, you'll see. Nothing can prepare you for this. Oh, yeah. they all, That does look like a military base. The Pentagon's probably one. Yep. Yeah, yeah, the Pentagon is a com- certainly a Star Fort computer. Well, right? I think this gives you some type of tactical advantage, though. Yeah, that that's too. That's why it's done. It could be that. That, sh- that shape. Yeah. Oh, oh, like, uh, oh, right, 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 right. Like, just from a, ge- from a, a physical it's, standpoint? It makes it harder to uh, try to siege, lay siege to a, a, a structure like that because um, you go in that way and there's towers that, Get you the other way, you know, something like that. Probably that's what I would imagine. You know, the great it's towers in the Great Wall of China. You ever notice when you look at the Great Wall, the like the defenses, the defenses for shooting freaking projectiles are mm. facing inside of China instead of outside. I just I couldn't really understand why that would be. But isn't that amazing, Chris? Like, you're gonna yeah, be yeah, busy yeah. today. Amazing. Yeah. The Star Fort's the craziest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> we got we have a ten year old girl telling us to build a bio uh, electric tanks. Yep. <laughs> Solar tanks. So yes. you're saying that the it's facing this way. Yeah, it's facing inside and not outside. So it was either there before or it was there to keep people in. Like, who knows? I mean, I don't know. I mean, you you, you could make something up and it would be closer to the truth than from history. Why are you going to leave? You're having so much fun. Get back in there. <laughs> 15 shoot, minute cities. Shoot out of into, into here. That's kind of strange how it's on the inside. I always thought, well... That's kind of strange. We need GeoGuessr to tell us what the fuck we're looking at. You here. tell by the font in that one. That, that's a smart one right there. Mm-hmm. How is the Great Wall of China defended? Wall, block enemies where soldiers patrolled. Dude, you guys built it the other way. <laughs> Rick's going to be pissed. <laughs> fuck it. We'll just shoot him out that way. It's just like the chilies in Lincoln. It's like flipped out so the so the the entrance is in the back and the fucking bullshit's in the front. That's so good. <laughs> That's so funny. They thought oh, they were gonna shit. build to the road. Yep. And they didn't change the plan. They're like, build it like the one in Wisconsin. They're like, no problem, got it. Oh, the mall's in the back. Oh.